Hello and welcome to Psychology in Seattle. I'm your host, Kirk Honda, licensed therapist. It's just me today. I thought I would dive into the negative therapeutic reaction. In my efforts to help therapists with their work, I have investigated several topics related to treatment failure, and the negative therapeutic reaction was one of those topics. But first, a little disclaimer. I am by no means a Freudian or psychoanalytic scholar. As a psychodynamic therapist and professor, I have studied the history of psychoanalysis, but not to the extent that would make me an expert. Also, another disclaimer, I am in no way going to be able to summarize every nuance and tributary of this topic that I know of. Almost every topic related to psychoanalysis and psychodynamic theory has been expanded upon by many, many authors over you know the past 110 years or so. Um, some of them are brilliant, and some of them are strange, and some of them are both, and some of them are not so brilliant or strange. And so it's a complex area that is difficult to summarize very quickly, but I will attempt to provide a useful summary. Okay, so, um, so first off, I have a few questions for you. Is it possible for psychotherapy to always succeed? If psychotherapy helps someone, then the therapist is likely to attribute that success to the therapy or to the therapist, him or herself. Uh, but what if therapy doesn't work? What if a client's symptoms get worse? Treatment failure has been a sore subject for therapists since the beginning of the profession. It's rarely discussed. Um, personally, I attribute this lack of discussion to the self-serving attitudes of those in my field. It's so much easier to blame others when we fail, right? But before I get more into that area, let's take a trip down history lane, okay? All right, so in an attempt to understand why some of his patients were getting worse with psychoanalysis, Sigmund Freud first coined the term negative therapeutic reaction in the early part of the 20th century. Hey, deserving listeners, this is an old episode that we have re-released as a patron-exclusive episode. So if you want to hear the full episode, you have to become a patron of the podcast by going to patreon.com. 